How are you doing today? My name is Jennifer Cook. I am happy to have you at my, on my YouTube channel and want to chat with you today about the book that actually, I think, changed my life. So about two and a half, three years ago, somehow I came across um, a YouTube video of somebody talking about books that they liked. Previously, I enjoyed reading, but I didn't, I read all nonfiction. Um, not nonfiction, I read all fiction. Um, so stories about other people and, you know, obviously fantasy world, nothing that actually uh, increased my learning or taught me to be a better person or developed myself at all. Um, just things that actually made me feel a little bit worse about my situation because they were exaggerated as we see in movies. So I came across this book called The Five Second Rule by Mel Robbins. And this book catapulted me light years into self-development and the person I am today compared to the person I was two and a half years ago is so far different. Um, I am a better mother. I'm a better wife. I am a nicer person in general. I am much more open to ideas. Um, I have learned so much. So I'll tell you a little bit about the book. Um, now the book itself is amazing. Mel Robbins is amazing as well. But what it mainly opened me up to was this fact that if you're not learning, you're dying. So if you're not expanding upon yourself, then you're not, you're just stagnant. You're just sitting here. And we didn't come into this body, into this world from, from being an internal being, being in order to just, to, to just stay stagnant. So I'll read you just, obviously the statement on the book is really like, you know, long, but I'll read you what the five second rule does. Um, this is from the description online. So in the five second rule, you'll discover it takes just five seconds to become confident, to break the habit of procast procast procrastination and self-doubt. Beat fear and uncertainty. Stop worrying and feel happier. Share your ideas with courage. The five second rule is a simple, one size fits all solution for the one problem we all face. We hold ourselves back. The secret isn't knowing what to do, it's knowing how to make yourself do it. Um, I talked about this in a previous video, how we no longer have a parent to be able to tell us what we need to do, when we need to do it. And the book kind of talks about how, you know, if we only did what we wanted to do, we would do nothing. We would accomplish nothing. So what it talks about is a five second rule. So when you get an inclination to do something, you have five seconds before your brain turns it off or your brain sabotages you to tell you not to do it. So let's say you have an inclination to say, oh, I want to compliment that stranger and tell her her shoes look nice. But she might think I'm, and, and within that five seconds, you start thinking she might think I'm weird. Um, what if she doesn't like her shoes? You know, all this kind of thing. Or um, you say to yourself, I really need to go work out, but I really don't want to. And you just start thinking. And what you need to do is count backwards from five to one. And what it does is it lodges your brain and pulls you back to the prefrontal cortex of your brain. So essentially it makes you stop thinking. So as soon as you have a thought of action of something you should do, count five, four, three, two, one. I have literally now been using this for two and a half years. Every day, every day. I don't need, to, I don't want to work out. Well, I, of course I don't want to work out, but I need to five, four, three, two, one, and then I stand up, I just go. The other thing I do is at night, um, when I wake up and I want to get back to sleep, I count backwards from five to one so that I can stop thinking. It stops your thinking. It stops your irrational mind that wants to keep you stagnant, keep you back, keep you safe. So essentially the reason that you don't do things is your body wants, or your, your nat natural inclination is to keep you safe, right? It thinks that everything is dangerous. You don't want to do this, that, and the other. So that's great that we have that awareness, but it keeps us from expanding and it makes us feel scared about things that are not scary. So I 
actually used this on my daughter about six months ago when she would get upset um, and she does not throw tantrums. She is, does not get upset often, but when she would get upset, she would almost make herself sick. So what I started doing, it was really odd. I just kind of thought, well, maybe I need to take her brain and take her or take her thoughts off of this. So I started counting backwards. It worked instantly. And now whenever she would get upset, she says, mommy, can you count? Can you count, mommy, count, you know, in the middle of it. And it helps her. Um, so this catapulted me to a journey of reading and researching and learning about um, habits and self-doubt and um, so many things. Um, it led me to being financially uh, more intelligent because I read, I started reading more nonfiction. You know, people, you want to learn from people, why not learn from the best? Why not take these people's thoughts and actions and put them into place for yourself? If they're successful, then I can be successful. So I leave you with this. Read this book, check it out. See how it opens your mind. I recommend listening to it on Audible and Mel actually goes through her story. So it's actually wonderful. She's actually got a really nice dry sense of humor. So I recommend you listen to this book, um, but also take my advice that start learning, whether that's watching YouTube videos that help you expand your, your mind and your thoughts on things, or that's picking up a book and reading it or that's listening to a podcast. Um, it's really been huge and so beneficial for me in my life and hopefully it would be for you. So thank you so much for watching my video. Please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. I would love to have you back and I do plan on doing a video on the book. There's one book that changed my financial life. So hit subscribe in order to know what that is.